Due to the pandemic, for the second time in three months, the Mississippi Blues Marathon is happening right here in the capital city of Jackson, Mississippi. We've never done a race and then three months later do it again. So it's a first for me. Runners from all over the country were here in town for the event, including ABC News anchor Lindsay Davis. She said she and her husband are running a half marathon in all 50 states, and this was her first time in Jackson, Mississippi. It was nice. We did have nice weather other than kind of a chilly start, but uh, really love the music as we hear it now and, and throughout the race. There were a number of, uh, of live bands out there to kind of keep you going. So it was exciting. And as you can see behind me, with all the people who have come out, it is definitely having a great economic impact. I think it gives you the opportunity to highlight your business, what you can offer this large group of people. This is one of those marquee events that brings in, you know, three and a half to five million dollars of economic impact. That goes back into people coming, they stay in hotels, buying gas, flying in. Organizers are already planning for next year, which will be larger than ever and could have an even bigger impact. For next year, we're adding a children's festival, so it will be an event within an event, so we're already preparing for the 16th annual. And we're going to have music, God willing, till about 5 or 6 o'clock in the afternoon and make a blues festival out of this event. Marcus Hunter, 16 WAPT News.